This question is from Alex, and he asks, why is Jupiter called a gas giant? Now, Jupiter is the biggest of all the planets in the solar system. It's huge. It's 318 times the mass of the Earth. Much bigger, much heavier than the Earth. It's vast. You could fit more than 1,300 of our planet inside Jupiter and still have room left over for more. It's really, really big. And it's so big because it's primarily made of hydrogen and helium gas. When the planets formed, Jupiter formed just a little bit further from the Sun than a magic place we call the Ice Line. That's a place in the disk of gas and dust around the young Sun where it got cold enough for water to form a solid material, water ice. And at that point there was a lot more solid material for planets to grow because water is the most common or one of the most common solid materials there is. If you're cold enough to have water ice, you have a lot of solid. So Jupiter got to grow very, very quickly with collisions sticking small, small bits together to make bigger bits growing bigger and bigger objects until you grew something about 10 times the mass of the Earth. That protoplanet was mainly made of ice with some rock and some metal and that's the core of Jupiter right in the middle. After that, once it got that massive, Jupiter was able to start sucking up all of the gas from around it in the disk and that allowed it to grow very quickly because there was a huge amount of hydrogen and helium around, which meant Jupiter got to go from being 10 times the mass of the Earth to being 318 times the mass of the Earth very, very quickly, maybe in less than a million years. Then the sun turned on, got very active, and it blew away the remaining gas, leaving the massive planet Jupiter, mainly made of gas with a little bit of rock and ice in the middle. And when I say a little bit, that's still ten times more material than we have in the Earth, right in the middle of Jupiter as a core. But the bulk of the planet is gas, and so we call it a gas giant.